everyone. Good morning, Mr. Mister. Morning, Oakley. So today we'll be carrying on with our story, seeing as no one did it for homework like I said to. So if you guys want to do that, oh, the head teacher's just calling me. I'll be back in a second class. Be good and behave. Aha! Shiver me, Timbers. All right, thank you, sir. Oh, he scares me sometimes. All right, let me head back in here. Let me open this. Oakley, what are you doing on the table? I'm walking the plank. My plan is to feed the sharks with my book so they don't eat me. Here you go, sharks. Oakley, get off the table now. It's not appropriate. And now me. Whee! Oakley, that is your first warning. I do not want you to go on the tables anymore. This has happened too much this week. But, no buts. The pirates told me I had to. And you don't mess with pirates. Don't mess with me, young man. Back up your desk. Ooh, the land of food. Ah, oh, finally it's lunchtime. Okay, let me get my tray before everyone else steals it. Right, mm, I think I'll take a salad to be healthy. And then I'll take a hot dog. You know, hot dogs and salad can never go wrong. Dinner lady, I need you. Here's my food I need to pay. Got lots of marking to do. And I need a holiday. Yuck, salad. That'll be £100. Oakley, why are you in the kitchen? Oakley, I'm Sandra, the dinner lady, who's overworked and un underpaid. Oakley, out of the kitchen now. That's another warning. If you get another one, you'll have detention. It's Sandra who's on a warning. Oakley, one more time and you'll have a detention. You've held up the whole line. Enjoy your salad and hot dog that you didn't pay for. And you got her eye on you. Go join Philip and Charles. Ugh. Oakley has been up on my nerves all week. Last lesson of the day. And I've got those three kids again. Right, up oh, there's Oakley. Morning, I mean afternoon. Definitely not tired at all. Well, while we wait for those two to come back from lunch, we'll wait here. How was that hot dog? It was very good, Sandra. Uh, Oakley? What are you chewing? Sir, the air and my teeth. Oakley, what are you chewing? You're chewing gum in my lesson and no blowing bubbles. Am I? Yes, go put it in the bin. No, Oakley. Now, I like it. You can't be chewing gum in school. Stop chewing. Oakley? Ugh, I don't want it. Oakley, you have detention. You said give it here. I said go over there. Ugh, I'll put it in the bin then. I thought you wanted it. It's your fault. Oakley, stop shouting. Sandra should have detention, not me. End of conversation. You have detention and you with me. Go get a hairbrush. Oakley, that's two days detention worth. How am I going to tell auntie? Maybe I won't. Alright, let me finish washing up. I think Oakley should be home soon, so I'll grab myself a cup of tea. Bubbles is at dance class at the moment, so she will be there all evening till I go pick her up. Mmm, this is such nice tea. Oh, there's Oakley. Hi, Oakley. How was your day? Hi, auntie. It was good, thank you. Good, I'm so glad to hear. Would you like anything? Juice, please. Okay, I'll get you some juice. Hmm, I'm gathering orange juice because you have it nearly every day. There we go. I made a friend. Oh, did you? Another one? Sandra. Wow, lovely. The dinner lady. Ah, okay. That's that's cool. I'm, I'm proud of you. Well done. Thank you. So, what happened today? Any drama or was it all good? No, not really. Philip ate a leaf because I dared him. Right, so that's what you've been spending your time in um, lunch and break. But that is okay. 
I'm not judging you. I'm going to go get dressed. Okay, see you in a second. Oh, auntie. Yeah, I forgot to say. Um, I um, have an after school detention with Mr. Mister. What? Um, you have a detention already on your first week of school? Not as such. It's more sitting in silent and being good because I was bad today. What did you do? Although it was all Mr. Mister's fault. Silly man, who needs a brush? Oh, Oakley, I have to take you to school then, so quickly hurry up. Can I have cake? No, you have a detention. I'm hungry. Go upstairs and get what you need and then I'll take you to school. Mr. Mister took my gum. What will I now? Head upstairs, please. I'll take one of these umbrellas because I know it will be bound to rain. So I'll go get the car started and then I'll take him to his first detention. Uh, hopefully hurry up soon. I know we have to be there by half three. Oakley, you're... Oakley, what are you wearing? I'm doing time. Right, you're not in prison. You're just going to detention. Have to dress appropriately at school so you probably need uniform do you have a harmonica no i do not and frankly i'm glad about that well anyway let's head off because we don't want to be late for your first detention in the school which i said don't get a detention how will i play the prisoner's song you won't because you will probably be sat there in silence so seriously uh right it's only a few minutes away with Mr. Mister. All right, we've made it just on time. I think uh, Mr. Mister, who apparently is his real name, is waiting inside. Auntie. Yes, Oakley. I wanted to say, it could be a long time before I get out of here. But out of every relative I have, you and Bubbles are my favorite. Goodbye. I'm coming in with you and thank you. I'm very glad that, what about Ducky? That's quite rude, but anyway, Oh, come on then. Oh, I think Mr. Mister's over there. Ah, Miss Snow. It's lovely to have you here. As you know, Oakley has detention and I have no idea why he's dressed up as a prisoner. Ah, uh, yes, he, he says it's, you know, I'm not going to explain what happened. Well, I would like to have a chat with you. Oakley, detention room now. Oh, he is a bit strict. What do you want me to do? Grab the lockers of graffiti, pull gum off the desk. I'll explain what your punishment is in a minute. Head up now. See you later, Oakley. I'll see you at half four. Bye, Auntie. Right, I'll uh, see what Mr. Mr. wants to talk about then. Okay, just in here? All right. Right, Oakley has been quite rude today. First, he was on the desk when I left the room pretending to be a pirate. Oh dear. And then went into the school kitchen and pretended to be a dinner lady called Sandra. Oh, that's who Sandra is. He told me about her. You shouldn't be laughing, Miss Snow. It's not very nice. Then he was chewing gum in my science lesson when strictly that the rules say no eating in the lab. When I told him to go put it in the bin, he put it in my hand. And that's why he has detention. Wow, that is a bit... Yeah, a bit... Gross, yeah, gross. Um, yeah, I'll wait in the reception area while you sort him out for the an hour and a half. Thank you, Miss Snow. Detention room. Oakley. Oakley, what are you doing in my chair? What's up, bruh? How can I help? Oakley, this is not a laughing matter. Get out of my chair. You're lucky the head teacher isn't in today. Right, what I want you to do is... Hmm, trying to think of a good punishment. Oh yes, I know what I want you to do. Write 100 lines in your book of I will not put gum in sir's hand. I think you need a coffee to calm down. I'm all right, thanks, but I will have a coffee. And then I want you to scrub all the gum off under this desk. And then I want you to um, wash the floor. What am I writing? My teacher should get a hairbrush. And chill out. You're lucky that I'm not giving you detention tomorrow. I want you to write not to put gum in sir's hand. 
Right, I'll be over here watching TV. Don't disturb me unless you have finished your punishments. Ah, finally. This an hour and a half will be great when just watching this. There we go. TV on. Yawn. I will put my gum in Sir's hand. I will definitely put my gum in Sir's hand. Alright, let me put this on the board. Oakley? Oakley? Where are you going? Oakley, get back here. You may ask to use the toilet. I need the loo. You shall not leave my classroom without me telling you to. Can I go? Go quickly. Let me check his book. I will put gum in Sir's hand. I will definitely put gum in Sir's hand. <gasps> uh, that is detention for tomorrow, definitely. Unless he can prove himself by doing the rest of his punishments. Oakley, there you are. What? Why do you have an apple in your hand? Because I'm hungry. I didn't allow you to get food. You're meant to be learning in this. Where's my work? I ripped it up because it's not what I told you to write. What? Mm -hmm. You're meant to set an example, mister. As I ripped your work up, you have to clean the floor and scrape under the desk. You have about 10 minutes left, so you best chop chop. Oh, it's getting late as well. I want my dinner. The mop reminds me of someone. Who? Who, Oakley? Or do you want another detention tomorrow? With bad hair. <gasps> me? Wow. Well, at least you didn't say it. You just pointed. Well, you can hurry up mopping all this. I'm cleaning. Leave me alone. Alright, um, I'll most happily do that. Oh, Oakley's report. Alright all of this information down i can't wait for parents evening next week did i mention you're amazing and the best teacher ever a minute ago you were just saying that i had bad hair and i couldn't do this without you and i never said true well thank you i'll take that as a compliment but i guess i could leave this one off but i will mention he got detention all right oakley you've done all your punishments for now and it's time for you to go home. Freedom! See you tomorrow. Nice spending extra time with you, sir. Wish I could say the same thing. I must be your favourite. Oh, finally. Yay! I'm free as well. This has been the longest hour and a half I've ever had. Oakley, have you finished now? Auntie, you're finally out. Yes. See, I told you I weren't in there for that long, actually. I'm free! I think your teacher's very happy about it. Did you miss me? I got an apple. Wow, you got an apple. I did hear shouting upstairs, but let's go. I've got your maths homework with me. Your teacher gave it to me once he left. How did you like Mr. Mister? He was rude. I can definitely tell why you got detention. He is! But you definitely can't get detention again, okay? Um, you also mentioned to me parents' evenings next week. I may have it tomorrow. What? Oh, no. Well, you can stay here after school tomorrow and I'll come collect you um, after. Depending on how nice he's feeling. Yeah, he's a, he can change his mind. But let's head home. Bubbles will definitely need picking up now.